Hey guys, it's Jeff. Just got done diving Monito Island here. There's a section called the Boulders. Stunning. Monito is the sister island to Mona Island out here in the Mona Passage. This is a tough part of the world to get to. Today I'm on board the Juliet. She's a liveaboard dive boat and is about the only way to get out here just a couple of times a year. Diving in, the bottom looks like a shadow in the deep, over 100 feet or 30 meters down. Arriving on the sea floor, I find myself on the edge of a field of boulders that are larger than a house, and I start searching for a way inside. Finding a gap between two giant boulders, it looks like a tight fit. Initially, I struggle to find my way inside with the camera. But I sort it out and get in. Pushing through to the left, careful to watch my head and tank in the overhead environment. And I come out the other side. Following a sand channel, I search for another area to swim through. Pausing to explore the top of a boulder, I find it's teeming with fish. beautiful staghorn coral catches my eye because they're considered critically endangered, having lost over 80% of their population in the last 30 years. Finding another pair of boulders resting against each other, I see a small passage that I can swim through. Blackjack darts in and dives ahead of me. Pushing through, I discover the only exit is straight up. Ascending, I need to watch my head again for an overhang that's behind me. The effort was worth it as the view opens up into an incredible V-shaped window that is flanked with giant school of fish. Looks like brown and blue chromis, some parrotfish and other reef fish are waiting on the other side. The reef here is gorgeous. Swimming back over the top, I'm ready to go explore the massive wall 
along the side of Monito Island. In the distance a reflection catches my eye. It's a pair of great barracuda swimming by and I pause to watch them. Leaving the barracuda behind, I turn to find a hawksbill turtle passing by. The topography on the way over to the wall is stunning. And I spot a queen angelfish showing off her bright yellow and blue coloration in the coral. Arriving at the base of the island, I follow the terrain towards the wall. The island has a rugged beauty to it from almost a hundred feet or thirty meters below the surface. Moving in closer, it becomes clear the entire side of the island is covered in coral and sponges and sea life. Ascending, I'm impressed to find massive barrel sponges that are clinging to the side of the wall. Blackjack approaches out of the sun and then darts off. The coloration of life along the wall is absolutely breathtaking. And I discover a series of little cavernous cutouts into the cliff face. Another great barracuda grabs my attention, followed by a blackjack. Who turns directly at me. Not many divers get to explore Monito Island like this. And the blackjack seems very curious about what I'm doing there as it circles around me. Moving up towards the surface, the wave action is rough, pulsating up and down, giving an oceanic trigger fish and myself quite the ride. Moving away from the island, I surface and wait for the Juliet to come by and pick me up. Pulling myself towards the stairs hand over hand, I can't help but feel lucky to have been able to dive this site and experience all the beauty Monito Island holds underwater.
Guys, make sure to check out another video of ours here at the end. We've done several on Diving Monito Island, as well as Puerto Rico and the U.S. Virgin Islands. Thanks for watching. If you haven't yet subscribed, definitely hit that subscribe button below and that bell notification so that you never miss a dive. But we will see you underwater.